Hello everyone, and today we're into some Lumion Legacy PvP, and is that a Gleam? No, dude. Or is it Gamma? I have no idea. But we are showcasing Swolder. We are we're running Robust Clever. We have 200 in the range defense. We're basically maxed out there. 196 in health, so I'm odd number for Icicle Traps in both level 50s and level 100. 68 energy. I'll tell you the Calc when we're in battle. 36 speed. The health speed is certain set. There's a Tower Claw, so I'm going to bring you for that. Also, oh, Wintrix is bad, actually. Wintrix is a nightmare, actually. This is going to be a tough team to beat, because I have nothing for that. This thing. I have nothing for that thing. I can actually beat Snagoop with this, though. Oh, I, Kimber looks awesome, actually. Kimber looks awesome in the saddle. Over Chartiki, though. Is it, is it better than Chartiki? I'm going to bring it over to Vesperatu. Hopefully that does not backfire. We're going to lead off with the Swolder. We have Protagon lead against my Swolder. And he's going to get a melee attack boost because that's what clever and range defense is. So, he doesn't know if I have... That's the thing. He does not know if I have that move or not. He does not know if I have Mega Punch or not. So, the threat of Mega Punch is scaring him. Although Swolder does nothing to... <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, this... I, I am going to swap out, and I want to predict Snagoot. I want to predict Snagoot. Although he could predict the swap. I'm trying to think, what should I do? To be fair, I, sh I, I should just poison, because Ice Hammer. Even if he goes into Snagoot, so be it. That's... That was good. That, unless I miss. Unless I miss. Unless I miss. Well, that sucks. I'm throwing a poison. I'm doing it again. I can live it. It provoked me. Dang it! I could have swapped for free. Yeah, this win trick. Me missing my poison really sucks. I'm weak to everything. I gotta go to Himber. God dang it. I just don't want to lose Himber right away. I just don't want to lose Himber right away. Just for Air Whip. Okay, he's definitely... He's Glide. Okay, he's the Glide one then. And I have no priority. Oh no, I have no priority. Although that means this guy can't hurt me. I did not place traps this time. I used Ice Hammer. Because I know how scary Wintrix is. So he's actually a Provoke Wintrix, which is very cool. He definitely doesn't want to stay into the matchup. Now that he knows that my Himber is smacking him, he kind of wants to swap. He'd probably go into Protagon to get that range attack boost. I do have Chartiki for it. I want to predict the swap. I want to predict the swap into Protagon. I don't see a big swap clicking, clicking Quick Punch. I think I'm just going to Ice Hammer. He does swap out, which is unfortunate. I could have predicted that. That sucks. That sucks a lot. I could have predicted the Protagon. But, you know, Quick Punch would have done more. How much does this do? Jeez, that does a lot of damage. We're going to swap into our Chartiki. Chartiki looks pretty good against the Protagon. I kind of need to go into it. He goes for Metallical Blast. That's fine. Does a lot of damage. I'm gonna go for. I kind of want to click Muck Blast because I feel like he's gonna. He would. He would not go into Snagoo because he's neutral to fire. I'm clicking Muck Blast. He does go into Snagoo. And it is a Gleam too, and it's a Gleam. Look at that. So it is a Gleam Snagoo. That looks cool. I really like the colors on that. Timber, come back in. I'm expecting Snagoop to also have barbs. Either barbs. Okay, he's a. Okay, he's got a. He's definitely. Okay, then I know what he is then. He definitely is going to try to barter me. Nope, he didn't barter me, which I'm kind of shocked about. Oxy Drake comes in. I outspeed Oxy Drake. I outspeed Oxy Drake. 
I outspeed the Oxy Drake, although I want to save him, bro. I could go into my Swolder. I could go into my Swolder. Swolder or Mutagon? Mutagon's the safest play, because I can actually use Telekinetic Sweep to predict the flaw. That might be what I do. He just goes to Rejuvenate. That's fine. I'm fine with that. He's weak, so I'm I'm free to clip Telekinetic Sweep. Something on this team is dying. That's not goop. Predicted the swap. That's big. Now I gotta hit it. And I got the hit. You'll love to see it. So, his Psycho is dead is good. That was a great time for me to read. Wintry! Ugh, I don't like that. I know I can Quick Punch, but... Honestly, I think I'm kind of forced to. Because Timber dies if I swap into it. I think I'm going to Quick Punch. Let's do it. I hope I can take it out from here. Yeah, he doesn't have Revenine. I definitely want to get Solder in, though. So Wintrix is out. Oxydrake comes in. I'm actually going to do this. I'm going to go into my... No, I don't want to go into Solder. Yeah. Yeah, Amelis is one of the better PvP players. Then again, I kind of have a... I kind of have an OU team, to be fair. Yeah, Himber Mutagon. Yeah, I kind of have overused. I will not deny that. Like, the only Lumion on most of my teams that are not... Wow, that's bulky as heck. That's a bulky Oxy Drake. Let's see what his last two Lumions are. Maybe I can bring Solder in against those two. There's Oxy Drake. Yeah, Mutagon's heavy carrying. His Protagon actually... I hope he doesn't go into Partagon, actually, because I want to beat him with my Swolder if I can. Darn. That sucks. I want to bring Swolder very badly. Hopefully his last Lumion... Hopefully his last Lumion is something I can use my Swolder against. I didn't really get to showcase the showcase Lumion. Hairclaw. That's a great moment, actually. Great time to go into my folder. I want to showcase. Gotta do my showcase Lumion. I want to use my showcase Lumion. Go for the Mega Chomp. He loses his speed, which is good. And we could just win with Solder. That'll be a GG. And we're going to head to the second battle. Unfortunately, I didn't get to use Solder that much in the first one. Okay, so now, I'm into the second battle now, and there is some scary Lumions. There's a Swolder, Cephalops I can use it against, Samarine I can use it against. So, there are a couple of Lumions. I can poison the Harvest Deck, which is awesome. It's actually one of the few Lumions that can kind of counter Harvest Deck, so that's big. I'm going to use Vesperatu. Barblast? Oh, I gotta bring these three for Barblast, basically. <laughs> yeah, Barblast is pretty rough. Uh, Zeppelin a good option. Zeppelin could be good for that Crack Lola. But there's a Himber. Himber is pretty nuts. Let's lead with. Let's lead with the Swolder. Oh, he does lead Himber, which is unfortunate. I'm just going to throw a Poison out there, because I think Solder can actually live one hit. There you go, there's a Poison. I think I can live an Ice Hammer. Sleet Shot Himber, you'll love to see it. How much will that even do? That does nothing, what the heck? So, I can actually Poison that. That's good, I like that. We can actually go into our... We can go into our own Himber, actually. So, we Poison the Himber, which is nice. He goes for Icicle Traps on this turn, that's fine. Does he have a Fire-type? I don't think so, I don't think he has a Fire-type. So I am actually going to play Icicle Traps, because I don't think he has a Fire-type. 
I sent this Timber's Poison, I win this 1v1. He does have any draft, which is scary. It's gonna be harder to get Timber back. It's gonna be harder to get Solder back in. Yeah, getting Solder back in is gonna be tough because of the Icicle Trap. I'll have to find a good moment to bring it in. Yeah, I do a lot of damage. That's a lot. Yep, Timber's dead from Poison. That's big. Yeah, I didn't bring anything for the trap. So, that's unfortunate. There's Cephalops. Which, honestly... I'm just gonna go for an Earthquake. I don't really need him for that much. He does outspeed me. He runs a lot of speed on that Cephalops. Oh, gosh. That ain't good. Come on, Solder. We need ya. I hope you up speed. I ran a lot of speed on that Solder. Okay, we're good. We actually up speed it. I think we win this 1v1. Oh! We crit and one-shot it. You'd love to see it. Back to full health now on my Solder. That's exactly what I needed. Cheat the trap. To cover up the entire Solder. Showcase Solder more like... Showcase half a Swolder. I could get Magma Blasted, and I don't like that. Yeah, that was kind of one of my only things for this. This could be Dust. I'm gonna go for Poison. I know he could be Mysterious Dust, but I think that's the best play I should do. He actually has Magma Burst. He doesn't even have the other move. Is that Volcanic? I have no idea. I think I'm gonna go for... I outspeed it. I'm gonna go for weight actually, because I wanna get my energy pretty high. And if that is volcanic, then that's insane. That it is actually volcanic. Oh my goodness. That is insane. That's a volcanic vocal that's a volcanic crackleola right there. He has dodge. He has dodge on a crackleola. Right when you haven't seen it all. Dodge on a crackleola. Painful Bash does some nice damage. He's gonna go down to Poison. That's big, actually. I can actually get a free Rejuvenate off. Burn sucks, but it doesn't matter. I'm mainly here to Poison, anyway. Don't die from Poison. Good job. So now, he's Recultivating. Gives me a free heal. Yeah, this is a really good battle with Solder. This is just right after the last one. There we go. And now... Solder doesn't do that much damage anymore. So I think I should just throw poison. Because I don't think... Because when I'm burned, Solder doesn't really hit that hard. Samarine. Yeah. You know, let's poison the Samarine. Why not? Let's poison it. <laughs> let's poison the Samarine. It's definitely rev up. Oh, I plunge. I completely forgot about that. I completely forgot about plunge. That's going to hit pretty hard, actually. That's gonna hit pretty solidly hard, actually. Very hard, especially if a critical hit. Lower its speed, though, but it doesn't matter if you rev up. I missed poison! Are you kidding? I missed poison. Only my luck! Yeah, this thing might sweep me. Oh no, I have, I have my other Lumion. I, I should be fine. It goes for plunge, it does. I basically get a free heal, but not enough for a poison. That's not good. Not enough for poison. I'm glad I'm just clicking plunge and not clicking other moves. I get a free rest, basically. I do get hard, but I think I can live this. Yep, I live it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I really want to get a poison out there, if I can. I really want to throw a poison out there. Okay, plunged again. Now, okay. Now, Swolder. Don't miss poison this time. This is a great time to hit a poison. And trust me, I don't think that Simmering wants to plunge when it's poison. He plunges again. I'm actually getting health back. I'm kind of stalling a bit. And that's because I want to use Solder very badly. He's doing really good in this battle, though. I can basically go for another Rejuvenate, actually. Yeah, I can go for another Rejuvenate. He should just attack me. He should not click plunge anymore. Yeah, he put Sharpen this time, because he knows that my Swolder 
He's tanking all his hits. He knows. I feel like he's just gonna click plunge. Looking at his energy, I feel like he's just gonna click plunge. So I am actually gonna go for the rest. And then I'm gonna Baneful Bash and see if I can do some damage. That's what I'll do. So there you go. Got my energy back up. He's going for another Sharpen. It's not helping you if you're clicking Sharpen. Yeah, him clicking Sharpen ain't helping him, because he has one move. He has one move, so he probably takes out my folder, and then something else comes in and beats him. So, yeah, that's not basically the best position. That's a bad position for him. Yeah, I'm fine with this position. Yeah, I think he just dies this next attack anyway. I don't think I live, unfortunately, but, you know, it's how it goes. At least got the poison on the submarine, so I can actually... I actually live to hit. That's insane. Baneful Bash, do some damage. Almost one-shot. Almost one-shot it from half. That's pretty good. The burn will bring me down in the next turn, but... If I outspeed this last Lumion, which I do outspeed Harvest Deck, I can actually... I outspeed Harvest Deck. I hit the poison, so we won. We won no matter what, basically. Full Harvest, that is scary. That's super scary, actually, because he actually gets up to plus two now. But... But... I'm in a very good position here. Like, this battle, it's in my favor. I'm going to go to Mutagon so he doesn't put perfect eyes. Plus, I do have to be Harvest Deck, so I can actually hit him with Telekinetic. And that's what I'll do. I'm pretty much, it's forced to click Paris' eyes. Wow, I did a lot of damage. Soul Harvest? I think I live. No, I don't, but he dies anyway. We're good. Harvest Deck, though, getting that plus four, though. But he dies this turn now. I Shadow Sprint on Vesperado, and we win, basically. So, yeah, it's over. I did that so he didn't click Parasitize. Go for the Shadow Sprint, and that will be a GG. Then, yeah, Swolder did amazing in that battle. Swolder did absolutely amazing in that battle. So, yeah, there's Swolder. I didn't get it to use it too much in the first battle, but in the second battle, Swolder was a monster. Oh, I forgot to tell you the energy belt. So yeah, the 68 energy makes it so I can use a Rejuvenate, two Rejuvenates, and three Parasitizes. Or I can use one Rejuvenate, three Parasitizes, and a Baneful Bash with a Poison. So, yeah, this is really good. I like that. So, hope you guys enjoyed the showcase video for Swolder, and I will see y'all all later. Bye bye